not have an agent that will tell them exactly what we're talking about right now, they take their homes off the market, which means there's fewer homes available. Should you be selling your home during the holidays? Hi, I'm John Ray with eXp Realty and the Ray Group, and this is Cape Coral Living. If you haven't already done so, subscribe below and hit the little bell icon. It helps us to keep the word out to everybody here in Southwest Florida. First off, happy holidays. Merry Christmas, happy Kwanzaa, happy Hanukkah, whatever it is you celebrate, happy holidays and a prosperous new year. But during the Christmas season, we hear it all the time. Hey, John, I don't want to list my home at the moment or I don't want to have my mark home on the market because it's the holidays and nothing could be more detrimental to the sale of your home and the equity you're going to be putting in your pocket than taking it off and not having it on the market during the holidays. First off, you decorate your home. It looks the best that it will ever look all year long during the holidays. Why would you not want having to have your people that are coming in to take a look at your house to see it during that time? It just makes sense, right? Secondly, because a lot of people do not have an agent that will tell them exactly what we're talking about right now, they take their homes off the market, which means there's fewer homes available. That means a better overall price for you because now there's a scarcity of homes, even more so than there already is, there's fewer homes still in December than there are in January. The next thing that we also see every year is in January, that first week to two, an absolute gluttony of listings come on the market because it's the new year, we're gonna do the new thing. New year, new me, more real estate agents are doing business or trying to do business and re-kickstart their business or the sellers are now done with the holidays and they're all back on market, which means there's a lot more hom homes for buyers to choose from, which means your home doesn't get as good a an offer. It's not as competitive a market from the seller standpoint. So there's a lot of reasons why you want to make sure you're on market in December versus coming on the 1st of January. If you're looking for more tips on selling here in, Ca in Cape Coral in Southwest Florida, subscribe and hit the bell icon below. We'll be able to bring you content like this all the time. And if you have any comments about it, good, bad, pros and cons of selling during the holidays, DM me below or hit the little, um, the little comment button and put in there what your thoughts are on it. We really want to hear you about that. And at the end of the day, if you're thinking about selling, now is the time. These next few weeks before the, uh, the end of the year are the most critical. If you're not already in action at this point, you need to be getting with a good real estate agent group or team that can help you to get everything set correctly so that when you go on market, you get the best possible results, you get the fastest response, and you also get the most money in your pocket and best of all, a stress-free environment so that that way everything goes as smoothly as humanly possible. It's not supposed to be the most stressful thing you ever do. It oftentimes is, but it's not supposed to be that way and it doesn't have to be that way. Once again, I'm John Ray with eXp Realty. This is Cape Coral Living. Thank you so much for watching. We'll catch you next time.